These are the days of Elijah. Hallelujah, Jesus. Declaring Thank you, Jesus. The word Hallelujah. Of the Lord. We are declaring the word of the Glory Lord. Glory to Jesus. Thank you, Lord Jesus. We bless you, Lord. These are the days of His heaven. Hallelujah. Righteousness. Thank you, Jesus. Glory to you, Jesus. We thank you, Father. Kabaya bada brabada. Indo loboro shabada brabadas. Ito zozo golob robobo shabada brabadas. Thank you, Lord. The Lord of the Lord said, Behold, He comes, riding on, on the clouds, shining like the sun. Oh yes. Give job. Is the year of Jubilee, and of Zion's salvation come. Hallelujah. Oh, yes. Oh, yes. Rebuilding the temple of praise. Thank you, Lord. The last days of the harvest. The fields are all white throughout the world. Ah, yeah. Behold, he comes riding on the clouds. Listen, he's not talking. <laughs> Lift your voice. It's the year of Jubilee. Out of Zion's hill, salvation comes. Oh, he comes, riding on a cloud, shining like a star. At the trumpet's call, Hallelujah. lift your voice. It's a year of jubilee. Mm-hmm. Hallelujah. Hallelujah Praise God. Hallelujah. Amen. Word of the Lord. Thank you, Jesus. We declare the counsel of God. We speak for the word of God. Good morning mm. to you. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Good morning. Yes, my name is Pastor Joy. It is my pleasure to be here once again. Mm. This is Monday morning, the tw- the 30th day yes. of the month of January. Can we just lift our voice and thank give you, God Jesus? Praise. Father, we bless you. Father, we thank you. For Eco propose zo 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 bro go bozo de ando we bless you Jesus ka ba yando ko ra pata za de agosa you have been faithful lord you have been gracious your awesomeness is past finding we bless you endo zo ala ke ra badash glory to you Jesus Praise. Amen. We give you all the glory. Hallelujah. Thank you for another day. Mm. Thank you for another week. Mm. Thank you for the ending of this month of January that will happen tomorrow. Mm. And thank you for the month of February you've already prepared and waiting. Yes. We want to give you praise. Amen. Thank you this morning thank for you, everyone Father. hearing our voice. Yes, we want Lord. to thank you for their life. Thank you for the life of everybody hearing us Thank today. Thank you, Jesus. I am praying that the life you have given them this year, they will not useless it. Amen. They will maximize it to your glory. Amen. And I'm praying that anything keeping them from fulfilling what you have given to them, that it is broken Amen. in the name of Jesus. Amen. Blessed be your holy name. Hallelujah. Lord. In Jesus' mighty name we have prayed. Amen. 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 Good morning, amen and amen. Morning to you. Good morning. How are you doing, Pastor Hello. Joy? I'm doing great. Praise God. God is a faithful God. Oh, yes. And He's been keeping us. Yes. And I believe that this is the year mm-hmm. that you must overcome. Amen. You must choose to overcome in victory. You must choose to overcome in mm-hmm. in the power of God. Hallelujah. 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 So this morning I believe the year is coming to an end and God has positioned this year mm. to be a year of spiritual victory for us, mm. a year of financial victory for us, a year of all-round victory. Hallelujah. Because I believe that God has his intent for you, his plans for you, yes. and I know that your life will never remain the same again. Amen. But Pastor in the course of the weekend, we celebrated 17 years of, um, um, mar- um, of marriage. That's um, 17 years anniversary. God has been faithful. So faithful. 17 but years. It looked like yesterday. It looked like yesterday. Yes. It looked like Come yesterday. 
but God has been so faithful, Excellent. so faithful, awesome. so faithful. Hallelujah. Amen. I so, guess. Pastor Joe, what do you have to say? Yeah, concerning it's been 17, the 17 years. years. Yes. <laughs> Just mm. like yesterday, mm. just like yesterday, yeah. you know, we began this journey together and we have seen the mercy of God, mm. the faithfulness of God. Mm. I don't know. I don't know how to explain it. God has yeah. blessed us with four beautiful children ah. in the course of this 17 years, mm. being a parent, being a mother, being a mm. wife, mm. you know, I, I just want to give God praise. Yes, to him, to, God praise. to him so be all the glory. To him be all the glory. There are so many testimonies we can't go into, mm, yeah. but I want to thank God. I especially want to thank Grantly Morris, mm. Vicky Morris, God bless you so much. And mm. I want to especially thank Julie. Julie mm. Morgan, God bless you. Laurie, God bless you. We want to thank God for your lives and what God is doing. And this mm. year promises to be awesome. Mm. Full of the promises of God for our life. God bless you mm. in the name of Jesus. We want Amen. to thank God for everyone that have wished us and prayed for us. A lot the of gifts people. and A everything. Lot of people. We A want lot to of thank people. everyone. And mm. God bless you all in Jesus' name. Amen. We are pastors. God called us to speak for his word here in this Land, we have been declaring the word of God. God gave us this command to speak forth his word. And I began, I say it often that when we speak the word here in behold your God, we don't just speak to people. Yes, sometimes what we speak, people understand it and some of them need to correct their ways. But majorly we declare and speak forth the word of God into the land, into the situations that are holding the people. Mm. We declare the word that breaks chains of darkness, that binds unclean spirits that releases the blessing of God in the people and that is what behold your God is all about we've been here and this is about two years old almost mm. two years now on earth to the glory of God and today we continue again we are concluding actually what we are going to do today 30th of January and tomorrow 31st of January will be declarations mm. of the year mm. the declarations we're going to make is for the year 2023 we are declaring and I want to read a scripture yes the first scripture I want to read is from the book of Psalms, chapter 149. Thank you, Jesus. Psalm 149. I'm going to read from verse 5 to verse 7. Daddy, are you there? Oh, please. Hallelujah. Okay, I read. Amen. He said, Let the saints be joyful in glory, mm. and let them sing aloud upon their beds. I like that. Let the high praises of God be in their mouth and a two-edged sword in their hand to execute judgment upon the hidden mm. and punishments upon the people to bind their kings with chains and their nobles with fetters of iron to execute upon them the judgment written this honor have all his saints. Praise ye the Lord. Amen. You know, the declarations we're going to make today is a declaration for all the months of this year. Mm. This January happens to be the foundation, the beginning. And the Bible says if the first one is holy, yeah. then the rest will be holy. holy. Most people are praying and fasting for, from January for the year. You know, it is something that is noble. It is something as in you are presenting the entire year to the Before Lord. Now, God. God has his plans for the mm. year. God mm. doesn't just allow things to flow. I just discovered that every phase of life, God has planned it. And when things go out of the way, it is not pleasing to God. God always wants people to understand he mm. has his plans. He has his purposes. Mm. Now, God has already planned the things he wants to do in your life. Mm. Some of us, there are years of piled up things that are supposed to be done that are not yet done. Don't be scared about it. God says he can restore the years. The canker worms, the palmer worms, the caterpillars have eaten in your life. God says he can restore it. So in case you are within the category of those who have, you know, you know that years have gone and mm. you've not been able to lay hold on what you've been. This is another year. Yeah. And that is that's, why we are making this true. declaration. That's true. That is why we are making this declaration. It's another year set before you. Mm. And my prayer is that you will not be distracted. The Sometimes if Jesus. the devil couldn't stop the word of God from coming to you, you will hear the word of God. He will bring procrastination. He will bring some things that will make you to say, oh, I have some other things I can 
can do before I start looking into this. Any other thing that is taking your time from looking into God's counsel and God's plan for you mm. is a distraction, is a destroyer in disguise. So having understood that God already has a plan this year and that he wants his plan to come to pass, Mm. We begin to see here in Psalm 149 how God has commissioned us to do something. I want to go back to that place again. Daddy, are you there? Can you help me read it? Yes, please. Yes. Hallelujah. Yes. You say, let the, let the saints, that's verse 5. Okay. Mm, let the saints be joyful in glory. Let yes. them sing aloud upon their beds. Wow. Let the high priests of God be in their mouth. Yes. And the two edges sword in their hand. Yes. Look so, at this verse. Okay. Before we continue this verse, yeah. he talks about the saints of God being joyful. Let nothing take your joy this year. Let nothing tamper with your joy. You know, it's a decision. Some things may happen. You may not control the situations and circumstances that may mm. come your way, yeah, but right. you can choose to be joyful. joyful. You don't allow circumstances to determine your joy. This year, choose to be joyful. Hallelujah. He said, let the saints of God be joyful he now said let in them glory sing okay. let them sing aloud upon their bed upon their bed uh, you know on the bed people worry a lot on the bed they think they think a lot on the bed <laughs> they count the ceilings mm, yeah you, you, they count the ceilings they look at what you has know, not days, they don't have ceilings again yeah oh no <laughs> whatever pop or whatever mm. <laughs> so but the thing is it, it, the bed is like a place of you know, David also talks about the bed of affliction. Mm. So the bed is where sometimes people retire to take inventory. Mm. Mm. To take inventory. So so he said you should sing aloud on your bed. Aloud, not singing aloud. in your mm. heart. But, not playing the mm. music. Yeah. Sing it. Yeah, yeah, sing. My Just God. sing. Sing Just aloud. Sing. sing. Why? Aloud. It mm. has a purpose. It yes. has a place. Sing aloud mm. on their bed. Mm. He now said, let the high praises of, of God. God. Be where you are the there amount. you may be laying on the bed and you are releasing battles against what is holding you he said let the high praises of god be in their mouth when the high praises of god mm. is coming out sometimes it's lying down on the bed praising god yes and it is a high praise it is not a praise your momo and you are singing as if you're tired you are lying down you're about mm. to retire but mm. lift up your voice and sing high praises the mm. bible says when these high praises are in your mouth the two edges sword will be in your hand mm. you have to be conscious of this the high praises of god he goes together with the judgment upon your enemies. Mm. Now the seven says to execute, to execute vengeance, vengeance upon the hidden. Come on now. And punishment upon the people. Papaya. When you are doing that, you are an executioner. You are not the one that made the law. You are actually carrying out the law that has been made. And what is that law? That this year God has said, mm. I know the plans I have for you. God has said, all the years the canker wants, the palmer wants, the caterpillars have eaten in your life. He is about to restore it. Why are you executing vengeance? You are executing vengeance and that is what we are doing today and tomorrow as we conclude the month of January. What God has said concerning you, what God has said concerning your marriage, what God has said concerning your family, what God has said concerning everything that concerns you, that the devil is content wait it doesn't matter yes. maybe it will come in the month of march mm. maybe in august mm. whatever time mm. that it comes upon you you should be able to know Hallelujah. that god has already defeated the enemy mm. he said to execute judgment upon, upon the, the hidden enemy. and punishment upon the people now when you talk about punishment upon the people we don't punish the people no we bless the people but there are a particular group of people they have chosen to be agents of darkness you look at them they look like ordinary people but if you can if the lord opens your eyes you begin to see that that these mm. ones are walking in with the with the devil with mm. powers of wickedness i am talking about the witches here i'm talking about wizards yes they can broadly come out and tell you that i'm a witch i would do just imagine that the bible says this kind of category of people they are the ones that we execute judgment to punish they need punishment
judgment because they will see a life going properly and they will just hinder they will just release afflictions they will just release all manner of spells you wonder somebody you know there are normal circumstances that things will come that is a natural thing but there are interferences that is beyond that that is done by powers of wickedness god says execute judgment upon them we're going to do that today and then he says to bind their kings with chains hmm. and their nobles with fetters of iron. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. When we make these declarations, we bind the kings. Who are the kings? These are princes of darkness. Principalities. Principalities. They rule, oh, they rule as kings. The Bible says they are nobles. We bind them with fetters of iron. To execute upon them the judgment that is written. You know, that is already written. God has written the plans he has for us. Yes. We're going to read it today. He also has written a judgment for our enemies. He said, every tongue that will rise against us in judgment, what happens? We shall, we shall condemn. condemn. Why do you say tongues? When tongues are speaking against you, they are speaking enchantments, contradictions. They are mm. invoking things. The Bible says those kind of tongues, you condemn. do what? condemn you condemn and them. this is the heritage we have this is only one of the other written Gaba, judgments Gaba yes he said i've given you power over all the powers of the enemy mm. throw down pull down destroy and then black build and plant mm. we are declaring that the plans Bakula, of god Baka, the purposes of god yes lord the agenda of god mm. for my life for your life, everyone hearing us mm. this year, whatever be the plan of God in your life, that is what is going to come to pass. Mm. And any agenda of the devil that might have followed you before now and is still planning to continue its followership this year, you're going to cut it off. In the name of Jesus. Any agenda of the devil that is planning a snare for you, you're going to destroy it. You know, when we just say it doesn't matter, I'm living my life, you are walking like a time bomb. You are ignorant of the fact that there are powers of darkness resist. The Bible says we should not be ignorant of the devices of the enemy. Of the enemy. Mm. And that is what we are declaring today. Yes, Throughout so. this year, every plan, Mm. Every purpose mm. that God has for us will come to pass, mm. and there is no alteration. God said, Because Zachariah, I was only a little angry with my mm. people, but the enemy has forwarded, forwarded their affliction, stretched it beyond proportion. We affliction. are forbidding it this year, we are forbidding prolonged, unnecessary wandering and dryness, oppression, affliction. Pray. We are rejected in the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. Amen. Are you coming here? Amen. Yeah. Praise God. So Hallelujah. you see, um, I, I, I want to mm. let you understand that you, you don't need to have a one time victory. Wow. You need to have a full blast victory. Praise God. Amen. I want to read the scripture Revelations. Mm. Just buttressing what Pastor Joy has said, how it's important that you 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 assess everything that mm. God has given you mm. and you stand your ground. And maintain your stand yes. and take hold of everything that is your provision yes. for 2023. Hallelujah. Now look at this. The Bible says in the book of Revelation, chapter 21, verse 7. Praise he Lord. that overcometh mm. shall inherit all, all things. things. And I will be his God and, and he, he shall, shall be, be my son. son. Hey. Oh, you, you're there already. Yes. yes. He that overcometh shall inherit all, all things. things. And I will be his, his God and he shall be my, my son. son. Very simple. This year you will have to put together the forces of the overcomer. Amen. Because as we are declaring, we are believing that you will lay hold on what has been declared Amen. and carry it into the year. Every month you reassure yourself. Mm. You reassure yourself of your stand to, to come to, to stand in the place of victory. In the name of Jesus. Hallelujah. Amen. Now look at it. The Bible says, He that overcometh, what are you going to overcome with? You are going to overcome in the place of prayer. What is prayer? Prayer is talking to God, talking to mountains, talking to yourself, talking to situations. Yes. Hallelujah. Amen. Talking to them. Jesus, the Bible says Jesus spoke to a tree mm. and cursed it, mm. told it never to produce again. Somebody said, why will you? He represented a group of people. Mm. 
that wants to stand and and not and not be fruitful so that others can be fruitful they are not fruitful they don't also want you to be fruitful mm. are you hearing me yes. jesus was going about his work so you have to talk to god you have to pray number two you have to study your word mm. the, sorry the word of god study the word of god take it in massive volumes and then number three this year mm -hmm. embrace the presence of god the presence of embrace god. the presence of god what does he entail be far from sin be far from iniquity mm -hmm. be far from wickedness mm -hmm. as you embrace this naturally you will overcome Thank you, naturally you will overcome because we are going to take the stand of declaration mm -hmm. and when declaration meets preparation a prepared life the only thing is you you see explosion of man, of the manifestations Thank of the you. things that god has promised you mm -hmm. so this year we want you to position your life so that the blessings of god the hand of god the spiritual buoyancy to which you can mm -hmm. manifest because whether people agree or not everything is determined in the realm of the spirit it is the spiritual that controls the physical yes. and we know that in the contentions of wicked and um, um, evil spirits and, and and the spirit of god's spirit you will see that it is righteousness that gives you the Mm. the bible said the righteous is as bold as, as a, a lion, lion. and believe me when you are bold as a lion you take the lion share <laughs> you take the lion share Thank so you. this morning what are we saying we are going to make declaration but you have a part you have a part to play mm. we won't declare you can't be fornicating we won't declare you can't be living loose you won't declare and then you just be living as you like and we will not declare yes and forget who you are we will not Thank we you. will declare but we believe that Amen. god will position your life Hallelujah to experience the mm. declarations mm. for 2023 in the name of Jesus. Amen. Pastor Dear, please. Thank you, Jesus. Mm. What is that plan? We're going to look at it. Mm. The plans you are going to secure. Mm. You have to know the plans and mm. then you secure it. Mm. I'm going to read the book of Jeremiah 29. It's a popular scripture. You yeah. should know it. Jeremiah 11. Jeremiah 29 verse 11. 11. Yeah. We are reading 11 to 13. The Bible says, I said this because I know the plans that I have for you. This message is from the Lord. I have good plans for you. Did you hear that? I have good plans for you. Mm. I don't plan to hurt you. I plan to give you hope and mm. a good future. Verse 12 says, then you will call my name. That mm -hmm. is prayer. Yes. Reverend just, just said that now. Then you will call on my name. You will come to me and pray to me. That is God mm. talking. Mm. And I will listen to you. So, as we pray this year, just know that God is listening. Mm. You come to him. You mm. pray. You don't mean that you must come to church. You go to church when you need to be to church. But you don't pray because you are only in church. You pray everywhere. You have the consciousness. You are praying and that God is listening. Yeah. He said. Then you will call my name and, I will, and come and pray to me. And I will answer it. And he said, you will you search see? for me. Mm. And when you search. Are you there? Mm, for yes. me. Yeah. With all your heart. That's that. That's the word. You will search for me. You will search. Because in the word, you search for God and know Him better. You know what mm. God says, and you say what you will find me. Mm. These are God plans for you. When you find God, that means you carry the presence. Hey, of God. you hey. can't find God and go destitute. You can't find God and go empty. When you find Him, you carry His presence, and He says, "My presence when is with you." He said, "What a lady, O mountain, that thou skip it? Why?" Mm. At the presence of the Lord, that is God's plan for you. Mm. Whatever it is that looks as if it's impossible mm. when it confronts you this year, you're gonna be sure Amen. that the presence of God will confirm His Hallelujah. presence in your life. That's true, and that is God's plan for uh, you. Pastor, Dad, please, yes. do you see 14? Yes, very profound. Yes, and I will be found of you, mm -hmm. said the Lord. Yes, and I will turn away your captivity. Oh, you have talked about you see in 2022, there were things that didn't. Yes, we are not that's really. that, yeah. But this he said he will turn them turn away. away. He said, I will gather you from all Come nations. On now, now on. it is not from America or from Germany, it is gathering you from the mm. place of 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 uh, defeat, spiritual oppression, mm. manipulation, mm. empty handedness, mm. shame, lack, singlehood, chronic singlehood, anti marital wow. spells, wow. childlessness. He's calling you from the nation hey. of the barren 
I'm bringing you to the land every of the fruitful. Captivity. Every for me say I will I will break I will turn away your captivity and I will good. gather you from all the nations that and from all the places where I have driven you mm -hmm. said the Lord and I will bring you again into the place mm -hmm. when I caused you to be carried away captive yes. the original intent of God for your life yes. you are coming into it this 2023 that is God's in the word. name of Jesus Amen Hallelujah. and he wants you to know it Yes so when you are conscious of the fact that God has said that your captivity mm. this year, mm. he will take you out from Kaba it. Yagadash. When you are conscious Baga of the fact Labadash. that God says he actually has a plan for you. Mm. So you will come and seek him. Mm. Lord, what is that plan? Yes. This is actually my plan. Mm. Is it part of your plan? Mm. This is what I intend to do this yes, year. Yes, yes, Don't yes, run yes. without God. Such you will you. run and be worried mm. if you don't run with God. Bring those good plans bring it before him pray about it i didn't mean ask for prayers pray about it yeah. when you hear god you walk well when you are led of god nothing can stop you mm. you will not stumble mm. you will not hit your feet against any stone mm. when he leads you he will lead you in the path you should do now these Jesus. are the plans he has for you Kaba he Yabada. plans to bring you to your place of safety the place mm. of peace mm. to the place of good future mm. of prosperity. you don't guess about it you don't you're not like am i sure that god wants me to enjoy good things that is his plans for you now you are going to Kaba resist Kaba because Kaba if you are not Kaba aware Kaba. that the ya devil kapa, is kapa, trying kapa, to make kapa, sure kapa. that you end ya up kapa, frustrated kapa, this kapa, 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 kapa. If you are not aware in the name that the of devil's Jesus. plan is to repeat what he has mm. done before in your life. If you don't know it, there are greater things God has in store for you. You are mm. going to pray and then trust God as you stand with us as we make these declarations. Mm. These are God's plans for you. Now he said it's a good judgment. Anything that comes against Kaba what God has said, e you are going to lift Gadesh. up your voice and say, the Devil, you can't, you can't come near my baby. You can't come near my marriage. You can't come near my husband, not my wife. You can't come near my ministry. You can't come near my business. I lift up my Voice, yeah, I ba, 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 go, go, rabba, da, in so the name these of are Jesus. Recent judgment. Mm. He said, I know the plans I have for you. Mm. He said, There is no weapon formed against which that shall prosper. Mm. These are God's own plans for you. Hallelujah. Now, He also has given us the room to make declaration. He said, I have written out this judgment. Please read that place for yourself. The book of Psalm 149. Read the entire place. Yeah. You're going to see what God's plans. He said, You're going to praise God, be joyful throughout this year. I mean, mm. throughout this year. Throughout this year, it yeah. is a mindset. When the psalmist said, I'm going to bless the Lord at all times. His, his praise shall, shall continually be in my mouth. my mouth. He decided to praise mm. God at all times. Of course, you and I know that you are not expecting good times all the time. But no matter the time, choose to be joyful. The Bible said, let them be joyful upon their bed. Mm. And then lift up your voice and praise God. Mm. It's called a high praise. Praise God Thank you, Father. and give him praise. Father, we give you Kaba praise. Galabada. You have kept us Yaba, despite Yaba, the Yaba. attacks of the devil. The you have kept Jesus. us despite all the Ito enemy is fighting against us. Us. You have kept us In the and name we of are Jesus. grateful, Lord. Today we give you all the praise. We, give you all the glory. we lift up a high Baga praise unto you as we lift up this high praise. Rabba Lord, Rabba Lord Rabba into Zaza Zaza sword is in our hands. We Jesus. give you to execute judgment in the name of Jesus this year. We declare every cancer of God, every pain that is blood of God, every walk of weakness resisting it. We declare in the name of Jesus that all that is blood of God, all that is blood of God, in the name of Jesus, Keba la brabada, Ika para pado kora bashagada. In the name of Jesus, so shall it be. In the name of Jesus, so shall it be. In the name of Jesus, any work of wickedness that is resisting in the name of Jesus, Father, we break it down today. In the name of Jesus, Zaga baya kato kora pakata zaza. Judgment, intention of God, we execute judgment on our entire life. We execute judgment. We are the people of Raba God. Baba Zaga we Zaza execute Zaza judgment Zaza upon the earth. Raga Gada we Goro execute Zaga the wicked judgment. We are the people of God. We execute the wicked judgment. We are the people of God. We execute the wicked judgment. We are the people of God. We execute the wicked judgment.
30th of January mm. 2023, mm. we declare every agenda of the in devil, the name of Jesus. every plan of wickedness, in the name every of Jesus. spell, Kabagada every enchantment, brothers. every divination, dissolve. everything that the enemy is putting together to put in the way of the people of neutralize. God. We declare today Kabagada they are brothers. neutralized. In the name they of will Jesus. not see the light of Kabakara day. Father, we crumble them. He beats them down from their cover. Anyway, they are released Father, we beat it down. In the name of Jesus. We contend with it. We contend with it in the name of Jesus. And we lift up our faces. God says when we make this declaration, this execution, it will punish the wicked. To punish the people that are marked out for evil. Mm. We declare that everyone mm. who is an agent of darkness in whatever category you belong. We lift up our voice and declare this Fire year. Kati your hands are crumbling. The evil in your hands are crumbling. Amen. In the name of Jesus. Amen. You shall know that God is God in this. He Amen. is going to release judgment upon every wicked in agenda you are of Jesus. carrying out. We declare Ita in the name Kato of Jesus Kola the Bada condemnation Bada. from our Ita tongue Ita upon Kuto the Kuto Father, we release the blessing to have for your people. In the name of Jesus. Father, we begin to command blessings. We begin to command your blessings. Father, let the blessings you have for your people be In the name of Jesus. Yes, Lord. Stand upon the word of God. Stand upon the finish word of God. Yes, 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 yes. And go throughout this year. Tomorrow, we're going to continue this declaration in your life. There shall be nothing left that the devil will have as a hold over in the your name life. of Jesus. In case there are things already in your life, you know them, you need to confess them. You need to come before the Lord and say, Lord, mm. all these things I know, I know, I know. Mm. I know that I am I have been a struggle in this or struggle in that. Mm. I want you to come before the Lord. Handle it tomorrow. We're gonna conclude this declaration, and I can assure you from the first of February is the beginning of what God in has the for name us of in Jesus. this year. In the name of Jesus. Amen. I want to pray for somebody who yes. is not at peace with God. Yes. Can you pray for that person, Daddy? Mm, yeah. Yes, I, I also want to say this. I, I just while you while you're mm. speaking, I was hearing this scripture in my spirit. Yes. It, it's it's very clear. He said, as a man thinketh in, in his heart. heart. Some people are thinking defeat. Please mm. stop that defeat mentality. Wow. You are you that's why we said go with the word, yes. you know, take time to pray and then carry God's presence. Mm. Be far from sin. Yes. And as you embrace this prayer, we are praying now. I pray that God will give you a victory mentality. But Amen. you know, the first scripture we read, he said, He that overcometh. Please, let's pray. Wherever you are, say, Lord Jesus, Lord Jesus I come to you today. I, to you. I know that I am a sinner. I, I receive your word. Receive today, your word today. Every, covenant every covenant speaking against, speaking against me against is, broken. is broken. Jesus, Jesus I, accept I accept you as my Lord as my and Lord. personal Savior. Personal In Jesus' name. Jesus. Amen. Amen. Hallelujah. If God bless you. Prayer, Ma please, it mm. And talk to the Lord to lead you through this year. In the name of Jesus. Go into Amen. your day. Yeah, God Go rejoicing. Us. Amen. Go rejoicing. In the name and of Jesus. And for somebody, thank you. I didn't forget that, Lord. Mm. Thank you. Somebody, the Lord told me to pray for somebody who is having problems in their marriage. Mm. Just yesterday, it was yesterday on Saturday, we, Saturday. We, we, we celebrated our 17 years. Mm. We are still babies. We still have a long way. And we are trusting God all the way. My and God all God the is. days of our life, the Lord is keeping us as a couple. I want to pray for somebody who is having challenge Oka in Baka their Baka. marriage right now. Wherever you are, the same God that in helped us in Jesus. this marriage will help you. Amen. And every battle you are going Turn around. in your marriage, we arrest it right Keba now. Kaba kaba be behind Shabada those three Father, we speak peace in the name of Jesus. Marriage. In the name of Jesus, Amen. the Lord that helped us for these 17 years will help you. Amen. And for somebody, they say you're already 20 something years in marriage, whatever be the years, doesn't matter. What matters is the Lord being with you. The God, and somebody that is just beginning and you're having so many crises, hold on, the Lord will see you through. Amen. In the name of Jesus, Amen. Father, thank you for this blessing. God bless you. Today is a blessed day. It's a, ble it's a glorious day. Hallelujah. God in bless the name you. of Jesus, have a beautiful day. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Amen. Amen. Oh yes. Rebuilding the temple. Building the temple of grace. And these are the last days of the harvest. The last days of the harvest.